Congratulations on a, on a cracking film. You're so natural. Thank you. Oh, thank you. It so just much. kind of comes to you in a natural way. How did it all come about that Steven Spielberg chose you for this part? Um, I had to do, um, obviously, go through the audition process, which sure. um, most uh, actors and actresses sure. obviously have to go through. And I started off by going, my dad recorded me just on his iPhone, okay. um, which was uh, fine. And I never thought that I was going to get it, but I wanted to go for it because I knew I would regret it if I didn't. For sure. And um, then after kind of a while I was called back for more auditions and on my fourth audition I met Stephen in Berlin. Right, this is Stephen was, Spielberg everybody. <laughs> which was um, <laughs> one of the most amazing experiences of my life. I mean he's such a lovely man and so uh, he made me feel, I was so nervous, I was literally shaking when oh. I went to meet him but then he made me feel so calm and so relaxed and really welcome on the set of mm -hmm. Bridge of Spies as well because he was filming that in Berlin and he was just absolutely lovely and uh, then on my fifth audition I met Mark Ryland. Yeah of course because so, he was in that, that movie as well wasn't he? Bridget yes. Spies, so he would have been there. Yeah, yeah. and um, I met him in London when I went for my last audition. Uh, I think it was my last and I met him and he was lovely and we did some improvisation and we clicked straight away and mm. so yeah but um, I was absolutely thrilled to get the I part. Bet. I it's amazing, I <laughs> absolutely incredible. I uh, never thought about how famous either of them were and I still don't. I just think about how lovely they are and they've become two of my best friends in the entire world. They're like fathers to me basically. That's fantastic. And so yeah but um, I think yeah, but I was very kind of, when my dad actually said to me, like when we went to the first premiere, for example, in Cannes, there were so many people shouting, Stephen, Stephen. I like finally realised how many yeah. people actually really appreciate uh -huh. him. So. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It was an amazing experience. What were all those premieres like? That must have been a bit daunting, a bit scary. Yeah, yeah. Um, it definitely was. My first premiere was the Cannes Film Festival, which is obviously yeah. like quite yeah. a big yeah. film festival. And so I was really, really excited slash very terrified about yeah. going. But I had a really amazing time watching the film with kind of um, all of the kind of, there was a lot of the crew there and yeah. obviously Stephen. And People you know really well. Yeah. Sure. And um, yeah, and then, yeah, and then, but the other premieres, I feel like London was my favourite premiere. Was it? Mainly just because my family were there. Of and course. They got to see the film for the first time and um, they absolutely had um, some of my, my mum was saying that uh, my uncle Mike, who, uh, who is um, married to my nana's sister. Yeah. He, my mum was saying that she's never seen him express any emotional <laughs> thing at all. And then he said, he like, well, the said it was the best day of his life. And oh. so did some of my other grandparents. They must so. be so proud of you. They must be so, so proud of you. They've been experience. so supportive. Oh, well, of course family. they would be. It must be strange though, because in this movie, loads of special effects, of course. Yeah. So but some of the uh, things were actually built. Some of the... Um, right things in the BFG's house and some of Giant Country were physically built. Sure. Uh, and so was Buckingham Palace, which was absolutely amazing. Go. And um, you know the window that Sophie yeah, pushes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was built. Uh, oh, for okay. me to do and um, I don't know how many times I had to try and knock over that bucket <laughs> without it actually falling but um, yeah so it was really interesting to work with all the new technology um, but also it was kind of just what I was used to because this yep. was my first film so it was mainly just what I was used to kind of yeah. working with it all so mm. I kind of just kind of settled oh, into it. Oh you just go for it too right? <laughs> now is this what you're going to do? I'd be astounded if you're going to do anything else you know you want to be an actress and where do you go from here? I mean you've started in such an amazing way. Um, well I would like to be a director, hopefully. At really? Some point. Oh, yeah. that's good. We want more women directors. That's <laughs> yeah, brilliant. I like that. Yeah, um, <laughs> I think, uh, yes, we do need more women directors. <laughs> and I think also I would like to be a director um, because after kind of doing acting, I kind of think I've kind of um, watching Stephen and other directors yeah. I've worked with, I really think it would be an amazing job to direct something. And I make my own films all the time at home and do stuff you? so That's yeah cool. I like to kind of um uh do, use it uh, like I use different editing apps and stuff like that which are really really fun and um yeah so I w I'm not sure whether I will be doing any more films at the moment I honestly have um no idea at the moment where my future is going to take okay. me but um I think I'd like to do more presenting. I, oh, good. I've uh, done a couple of presenting You could do things. this show. You'd be great, actually. You'd be amazing. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. I just, <laughs> uh, I've 
done a couple of presenting things, but I really love presenting, so I'd like to do some more. But... Oh, do you know what? Whatever you do is going to be fantastic. You're a great, <laughs> Thank you great, so much. Thank great you. actress and an absolutely delightful young girl. Thank you for coming Thank in. Thank you so much. And the DVD's Thank out you. right now. Just in time for Christmas. Perfect timing. Thank you for Perfect having timing. Me. Thank, Thank you. you, love. If you'd like to see even more great guests, then click here. There are plenty more fantastic interviews to come, so make sure that you subscribe.